me and Hallie had a baby together. I wouldn't have chose no other person in the world to have a child with. We learning. She's a great mom. Like it's crazy. She's she's amazing. Like it's it's like I don't know what it is, bro. It's like wonder if the nails will give anything away about what my outfit is tonight. And y'all better keep my sister's name out your mouth. Thank you. So how did you I started make the decision yeah, to in start. 2020 during COVID, during the pandemic. For for what reason? Because you, My you... ex did it, DDG. He started it first, mm. and he told me to do it. Oh, he got a kid. He did. Congratulations to them. And yeah, How's so How does anyway. that make you feel? Chloe Bailey is reportedly furious at DDG for forcing Hallie to reveal her baby to the world when she wasn't ready to share that. As we all know, DDG and Hallie recently confirmed the pregnancy and childbirth speculations after they announced the birth of their bouncing baby boy, Halo. However, it turns out that Hallie didn't want to show off her son just yet, and fans are speculating that DDG forced her to do it for clout. Speaking of DDG, fans are saying that his ex, Ruby Rose, is pressed about him and Hallie having a child together, and she even thinks DDG trapped Hallie with a baby right when her career started popping off. But the question is, why would she feel that way after congratulating them on the birth of their baby? And is Chloe really mad at DDG for forcing her sister to reveal her baby? Let's get into it. So on January 6th this year, Hallie announced the birth of her and DDG's baby in an Instagram post, featuring her newborn's cute little hand wearing a bracelet that said Halo. In the caption, she wrote, even though we're a few days into the new year, the greatest thing that 2023 could have done for me was bring me my son. Welcome to the world, my Halo. The world is desperate to know you. DDG also announced in a post saying, my biggest blessing by far, son's son, never been so in love. While fans were congratulating the couple on their new bundle of joy, some couldn't help but notice that DDG seemed to be the only one very eager to share everything about the baby online. I mean, we all know how hard Hallie worked to keep the pregnancy to herself, wearing those big flowing dresses, trying not to show her belly too much. Now, it's not like Hallie was fooling anyone, especially not her detective fans. For context, speculations of Hallie being pregnant started flying around after fans spotted her in this video compilation DDG posted, doing what they referred to as the maternity waddle as she walked in the background. Then there were several shots of her wearing baggy clothing, like this pink baggy top she was wearing when she and her sister Chloe were interacting with a fan. Then there was this strapless dress she wore to the Women of the Year Awards in London that even fans had to admit was a clever way to hide the pregnancy. When Hallie attended last year's VMAs, she wore this flowing dress that had everyone saying for sure that was a sign she was hiding a pregnancy. A source told Page Six that Hallie stayed away from the pink carpet so she would not be photographed, and when she was inside, she was very mindful in the way she gave hugs and who she gave them to. After she posted the pictures from that night, fans went wild in the comments, with one person even saying, Hallie, you can't hide it anymore. Your cute little nose is spreading. OMG. Now, when the pregnancy nose allegations started trooping in, Hallie decided, you know what? Enough is enough. It's time to address the rumors. Listen, if I see one more person say something about my nose, one more time it's gonna be hell to pay and you know why cuz I am black I love my nose what is you concerned about my nose for leave me the hell alone her sister Chloe also addressed the rumors but only to tell everyone to keep her sister's name out their mouths wonder if the nails will give anything away about what my outfit is tonight and y'all better keep my sister's name out your mouth. Thank you. But that only fueled the rumors even more, and everything came to a head when Hallie was seen leaning on a chair on the table to get up around Christmas. One fan said, I already knew Hallie was pregnant after they dropped that Christmas video, and she was getting up from the chair. That confirmed it all for me. And then this fan said, lol, we knew for sure Hallie had the baby when she had that little Christmas onesie post-birth rattle. Congrats to them. Even then, Hallie didn't post about the baby until a week into the new year. It seems reasonable to conclude that Hallie didn't want to share her precious moments with the whole world, at least not just yet. And you can't even blame her because we all know how ugly the internet can get when celebrities post their babies. However, it doesn't seem like Hallie and DDG are on the same page when it comes to protecting their baby from the media because DDG has been posting. He started with the little April Fool's joke where he shared an ultrasound picture captioned, can't wait to be your dad. Well, now we know he wasn't actually fooling around. He just couldn't resist the attention and speculation that post would get. I mean, there's nothing wrong with a man being excited about his woman being pregnant with their child 
child. But it comes off as weird when the woman is THE Halle Bailey and she wants to keep things under wraps. Hours before DDG and Halle officially announced their baby, DDG dropped a video for his newest song Daryl Freestyle which shows him cradling a baby that's presumably Halo. If it was, that would make it Halo's first appearance on screen. The song also featured the name Halo in the lyrics, Silver Spoon Kid, I Know Halo Don't Want For Nothing. With DDG acting so obvious, sources close to Halle say she had no choice but to reveal her baby to the world. Since then, DDG has opened an Instagram page for Halo. The account's profile says it's managed by DDG but has not mentioned Halle at all, which led fans to believe that Halle did not want DDG to create the account. The account, which already has 49,000 followers, features one picture of baby Halo with a blurred face with a caption that reads, Went all black Nike tech today for Dr. Checkups. Nothing too crazy. Then DDG commented, Let them know, son. This drip getting wicked. Fans were in the comments asking, Why post the baby at all if you won't show his face? One fan pointed out, What's the point in making an Instagram for a baby whose face y'all don't want to show? Another person said, So you didn't want to announce the pregnancy for the longest time, but immediately the baby pops out. He has an Instagram account? Yikes, so much for attention. DDG also hopped in his YouTube channel to share his and Hallie's parenting journey so far. Me and Hallie had a baby together. I wouldn't have chose no other person in the world to have a child with. We learn it. She's a great mom. Like it's crazy. She's she's amazing. Like it's it's like, I don't know what it is, bro. It's like Again, there's nothing wrong with DDG being excited to share his child with the world. Still, it's clear Halle made a significant effort to keep him away from the media's evil eyes, only for DDG to be all over the place trying to put the baby in the spotlight. Sources are now saying that Chloe is reportedly angry at DDG's antics and is not happy that DDG forced Halle to reveal her baby. However, Chloe was excited to welcome her nephew to the world. She left a heartwarming comment under Halle's baby reveal post that read, Crying so hard right now. I'm the proudest sister on the planet. But if one person seems pressed about Hallie and DDG having a baby, it's DDG's ex Ruby Rose. Ruby recently appeared on Logan Paul's podcast Impulsive, and when she was asked about why she started her OnlyFans, she replied that DDG encouraged her to do it. Logan's co-host randomly brought up the fact that DDG just had a baby, and she was like, she heard, and congratulations to them. So how did you I started make the decision yeah, to in start? In 2020 during COVID, during the pandemic. For... For what reason? Because you, my you... ex did it. DDG. He started it first, mm. and he told me to do it. Oh, he got a kid. He did. Congratulations to them. And yeah. So anyway. That make you but then fans started dragging her for mentioning DDG, saying she could have just said her ex made her start her OnlyFans without mentioning his name. They then pointed out that she was trying to be shady by trying to insert DDG's name in the conversation, especially because DDG, Hallie, and Ruby weren't exactly besties after that t-shirt scenario. For those who don't remember, after DDG and Ruby broke up and DDG was already with Hallie, Ruby made a post shading DDG for giving Hallie a shirt she claimed was hers. The comments started a whole social media battle between DDG and Ruby, where DDG claimed that Ruby was just making noise because she was stuck up on him. Then Ruby claimed that he was the one stuck up on her, and even brought out receipts showing DDG trying to get back with her. Sources are now saying Ruby feels like DDG baby trapped Hallie right when her career started popping off, and fans have been saying the same thing for months. Ruby Rose dodged being a baby mama. She won, lol. Remember how DDG kept embarrassing Hallie when she was pregnant? I mean, this guy wrote a whole diss track calling her out for having fictional chemistry with her co-star in The Little Mermaid, while knowing he's insecure. Mind you, he was cheating on her with Ruby the whole time. That nigga DDG trapped her good sis Hallie. MF drop a song about being insecure, then she pregnant. Someone help. Anyway, from posting everything about his new baby to all this mess with Ruby, it seems like DDG lives for drama. But do you think he's doing it all for clout? And do you think he baby trapped Hallie? Share your thoughts in the comments and then check out this next video.